Well, this lovely visit came in about five o'clock last night. Left us with about three inches. It's wet and heavy, and it is cold and windy up here today. So, since I haven't put the front end snowblower on, looks like we'll be scraping the driveways a little bit later. But I'll be in my nice warm cab. Well, we're down in the garage, getting ready to go out there and tackle the two or three inches of snow that uh, was supposed to be a dusting here in uh, central New Hampshire. Um, I did not prepare well for this. Uh, I figured it would just melt, but we have a high of 29 degrees and wind chills down the single digits. So it will certainly be nice being in my nice B2650 with a cab. The heat just pours out of that thing almost too much sometimes. Uh, but I did leave the loader on. Uh, it's not something I'm going to use to try to get snow as it'll scrape up my driveway pretty good. Um, and unfortunately, the snow blower itself is still in storage mode. Um, it is all prepped and ready to go, but um, clearly not on the tractor. So the one thing uh, I've always struggled with um, is figuring out do I want to use the back blade to push or pull? So I'm hoping uh, some experienced operators out there that uh, use a blade on the back of these tractors see what their opinion is. I uh, would much rather pull the snow, but I also don't like driving over snow uh, before it's getting hit with the blade because it tends to pack down and you end up with all these ice strips or hard packed snow. But pushing, cranks my neck and uh, you know you're constantly looking out behind you um, and that's not much fun either so I'd love to hear what everybody else's opinion is. Um, this is why I created this channel is to really help myself and hopefully help others so we're gonna try it both ways uh, and see which way removes the snow the best um, and the most comfortably all right stick around
So, in my opinion here, um, it didn't really matter, at least with this amount of snow, um, especially with the icy conditions underneath, whether I was pulling or pushing. Uh, so pulling is definitely the much more controlled atmosphere and comfort level for, for me as an operator. Um, but um, I can also see where pushing it might be a little bit easier as well uh, when you're getting into some areas that might be a little bit tight, uh, which I'll have to do, uh, especially coming up here. Uh, what I did, this is my lower driveway, uh, just kind of brought it all up and brought it up to the top of the driveway. Now I'll flip the blade around on the 2650 and uh, we'll just push it off down to the side over here. So let's get that flipped around and then this lower driveway will pretty much be cleaned up uh, and then I'll have the upper driveway to do. Appreciate you all sticking around for uh, my little test run uh, for the first snow of uh, 2021 winter season. Um, I'd appreciate any comments you had or any experiences you have uh, with the same uh, back blade type snow removal. Uh, anything bigger than this, uh, it won't be long. I'll be putting the front end snow blower on. So thanks for hanging out with me today. Hope you all have a great weekend.